I do want to branch off my YouTube channel so you won't be seeing hair reviews more frequent but you kind of will because I do have a lot of hair reviews to get out <laughs> so yeah I just wanted to tell you guys that I will be branching off my channel hair reviews will not be every upload but today I have another hair review for you guys and it's going to be on the company the dual is virgin hair from off of AliExpress they contacted me asked me if I wanted to review their deep wave hair and they also chose the lens for me the lens that i received was 16 18 20 and 22 and it comes in this nice box right here that some aliexpress companies do tend to have i'm glad that it's not in those big ziploc baggies and yeah so basically on the box is the um tips to take care of your hair and a little bit of professional information about the company so when you open up the box you will receive your bundles placed in this box right here oops <laughs> also they gave me some eyelashes which is always nice but i tend to not like these because they don't look like how i want them to look so yeah so in your package you will get your packing list which comes with um you know your shipping address and basically saying thank you on here and also everything that is in your package so again i received a 16 18 20 a 22 and i received a pair of lashes as well two pairs each hair came in these plastic baggies right here and i was able to detect which bundle was which because at the end of the sticker there's it's like a, a whole bunch of letters and at the end it has the number and length on there so this one right here says 22 inch so that's how i was able to detect which length was which so this is the deep wave hair and it's 16 18 20 22 unfortunately they do not have a deep wave closure with this hair company and it kind of like irritated me a little bit because i don't like really putting heat on my hair unless i have to and in this case i had to <laughs> so i made this into a u-part unit and basically if you don't know what a u-part is it's basically a wig made with no closure so is where the closure would be is where your natural hair will overlap so overlap the track so that it won't be shown so that's how i made this is what i made a u part and i have very minimal leave out and i honestly really didn't even do too much to my leave out as you probably could tell i just kind of left it kind of poofy texture so that it could kind of blend in well with it and i want to the ends and that's pretty much how i blended out this wig right here and i just want to show you guys what kind of wig dome caps i use and this is it right here also the way that i have this on is it is clipped on so this is a clip on wig you also could sew it like i also could have sewed it down but i'm not able to braid i don't know how to so this was the quickest way for me to just clip it around the perimeter i have about five clips um, on the perimeter which is like two on the sides and one right here in the back and also we have one in the back right here but it's not really needed because the wig actually fits really snug <laughs> i've had this hair for about a good month now and this is like my third time wearing it um right here today i just put it on for the video i wet it down a little bit well like spritzed it and then i fluffed it out and this is honestly what i got now I was a little irritated with my real hair because I don't like I just rather wear a closure honestly I did have to like trim the ends because the way that I made my wig and the tracks lay I had to cut the 22 inch too because it was like sparse ends it wasn't even that much it was like very minimal like I just snipped them you probably could tell right here that I snipped it so it's honestly about like a 20 20 inch all together but it actually looks longer than that on camera i haven't been getting any shedding the only shedding i've got from when i trimmed the ends and i actually did that today but when i wear this wig i wear it take it off boom like and then when i put it back on I just spritz it down and that's pretty much it like this hair is very low maintenance if you guys want some curly hair or deep wave hair not too much to go on like my previous um 
week review that I did. If you guys haven't checked that out, make, make sure you go and check that out. I'll leave that down in the description box. But this hair is very low maintenance and it's cute hair for, you know, the spring. Because, you know, you guys, it's spring now and we want kind of curly, puffy, shorter hair. So, this will probably be a good alternative. And also, they are very affordable. I will leave the links to this hair down below in, description, in the description box. And that's pretty much all I have to say about this hair, you guys. Um, low maintenance. It doesn't shed. It tingles at the ends, but it's bearable. And it's also very, very full. This is only four bundles. And again, it does not come with a closure. So if you guys are going to be looking for a deep wave closure, you might have to go with another vendor. And that's pretty much it. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And follow me on my social media at underscore Raviana Simone. Also, there are wigs in my on my website. Make sure you guys go check that out. I'm going to leave that down below as well. You might see this one if you guys like it. Let me know. I'll put it up on there for sale. But um, since I have so many hair reviews, I'm probably not going to wear this wig again. But just let me know if you guys wanted to go for sale. And I'll put it on sale. And yeah, so I'll talk to you guys next time.